Hey, good day, friends. Bob McBride, Territory Manager with Purple Wave Auction. Coming to you from Coonrod & Associates Corporate Headquarters in Wichita, Kansas. I have the pleasure of introducing you to Randy Coonrod, the founder and president of the company. Purple Wave will be conducting their retirement auction on May 4th. Can you tell us a little bit about your company? I'm very proud of it. Um, the heritage of our company goes way back. We're a self-performing contractor, so that's why you see we have quite a bit of equipment back here. And we did all the trades, uh, so we did our own dirt work, steel erection, masonry work, and concrete work, and even delved in some of the finished work. In doing so, we acquired equipment. But I can't do this forever, or don't want to do this forever. I have some other things I'd like to do. So this is phase one of our downsizing Coonrod and Associates. Uh, we will have another sale at the completion of the remaining work. Explain the self-performing part of your business. What does that mean? In order to be a self-performing contractor, you want to have your own equipment. And so right from the start, we started gathering equipment. We buy both use and new equipment. We buy equipment that we utilize on our jobs. If it's equipment that we don't use very much, we rent it. That that we use, we generally buy it. Three stories and a below is the type of equipment. we. So we have lulls and forklifts and hydraulic cranes. And then uh, to perform our dirt work, you know, compactors, scraper, blades, that type of equipment. Masonry, uh, we've got the scaffolding and the mixers and the saws, all the uh, lift equipment needed with that. But we have always maintained a two mechanic shop. Uh, one mechanic stays in the shop uh, full time and the other mechanic is a field mechanic and will spend probably three days in the field. What I hear with a self-performing contractor is you own everything. So in this auction, you will see dirt work equipment. We've got a scraper, excavator. You'll see compaction equipment, aerial equipment, trucks, all the light tools that you mentioned, brick saws, scaffolding, all this sort of thing, skid steers, mini excavators. It's just a really mixed bag of, of equipment because to your point, you do every phase of a construction job. You also touched on your shop, which I think is important to potential bidders and buyers of your equipment. You thought enough of your equipment that you have a full-time shop and mechanic and field mechanic. Can you speak a little bit to your sort of maintenance protocol, so to speak? We've always had that. My father had a full shop and they had equipment. So I've kind of learned from them like I said, they would perform the ongoing maintenance of it. We can do major overhauls. It just depends on the timing when we're trying to get that piece of equipment back into operation, whether we send that out to be fixed or we do it in-house. We'll be selling some shop tools. We have a truck lift in the shop that will sell a hoist and a number of other tools, as well as your service truck. Mm -hmm. I'd like to touch on your retirement plan. You mentioned you still have work in process. So this, this auction that we're conducting is the biggest tranche, so to speak. We're liquidating all the assets that are at your corporate headquarters. The lion's share of the equipment will be represented in this first auction on May 4th, but you do have some additional jobs. I think you mentioned a couple years worth of work yet to yeah. complete. And this is the way we planned it. We're not turning it over to anybody else. We're going to make sure that's done. And then there's warranty work after that that we need to adhere to. But the bulk of the work will be totally done in two years. So I tend to fish and hunt and travel a little bit in the United States. That's great. So looking forward to it. Don't forget, folks, when you're watching this video, all the items will be online at purplewave.com. The bidding will close on May 4th. Uh, we will have two open inspections where you can just come during the hours of 9, uh, 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. on April 28th. And then we'll have a second open inspection on May 3rd, the day before the auction closes. So you can go to purplewave.com, scroll down to that May 4th auction. You'll see it there. Again, Coonrod and Associates Construction Company Retirement Auction. All the items sell at no reserve auction. Again, purplewave.com. Thank you. Thank you.